So a while back, I went to my local disc replay, where I went to search through the depths of the clearance aisle, where I found several gems I was considering buying, but only three of them really caught my eye. Nicktoons Attack of the Toybots, Rio, and Dora the Explorer for the Game Boy Advance. Now I've never talked about this on my channel, but I love Dora. I watched the show, bought some of the merchandise, I own a whole shelf of Dora DVDs, and heck, I even have some really cool Dora games for the PS2. But those gold mines are a subject for another day. So seeing Dora Super Spies, I decided to buy it. And fast forward a few days later, I sat down on my couch one day and played through the entire game. And how was it? The game kind of sucked. Now, I don't know what I was expecting considering this is a baby game made for preschoolers, but this was not a good game for the GBA. I mean, just look at Dora. And that's not to mention this game's crappy cutscenes. I mean, they're literally just PNGs of the characters poorly cut out. It's just like, ugh, look at that. And I know this is a game for kids and all, but there's absolutely no challenge to the game. I mean, I'm not asking for, like, Cuphead difficulty or anything, but I believe there's actually no way to die in this game. I mean, I'm pretty sure the only challenge is the little obstacles that you have to use your tools on. Oh yeah, tools. So this game's gimmick is pretty much just giving Thora different tools to use on certain levels to help get past certain obstacles. Which sounds good on paper, but it really isn't anything in-game. It really just results in just... Give Dora the goggles to get through the bush. She puts on the goggles and, and, and goes through the bush. You, you see what I'm getting at? Did I mention this game as a story? Yeah, those little cutscenes actually talk about something. I mean, the story is nothing crazy, but it's basically just a typical Dora episode turned into a video game. Dora's hanging out with her friends. Swiper comes and steals something from her friends. Come help Dora stop Swiper and get her friend's stuff back. Like, you, it's basic baby topics, but, you know, it's there. And overall, the game really didn't do much for me. But, I don't know, I kind of liked it. I mean, what did you expect? I'm a Dora fan. I mean, I went out of my way to buy this game. So yeah, as an avid Dora fan, I enjoyed my time with the game. I mean, it was kind of charming to see these characters that I grew up with being played on my DS. But as a regular, top tier gamer, I would never recommend this game to anybody unless you're just some parent trying to give your crazy Dora fan baby kid a game that'll set them up for an hour. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about this game. Despite all the negativity, this was still pretty enjoyable getting to go back to my old DS and playing these little silly games. and. If you want to see more like this, let me know in the comments below. I mean, I'd be down to make more of these kind of videos. And, with that all being said, don't drink and drive, kids.